dude. I'm basically just... Oh. There we go. Yeah. How's it look, guys? Uh, we can do some adjustments, because I'm using... I'm not using the official Game Boy uh, player software. I'm using the... Uh, the Game Boy interface, I think it's called. It's a piece of homebrew software. Excuse me. I'm using that instead. So we actually have, like, some adjustments that we can make to the picture here. I think I probably like 100%. think Zoom Zoom is good. I'm into Zoom Zoom. We need to, like, move the screen at all or anything, I guess. I mean, it is cutting off a little bit, isn't it, though? When we're at 100% zoom. It's not bad, though. I could adjust my settings on, uh, on OBS to make it fit better. But then that would fuck up my settings for the PS2, so... We'll probably just deal with a tiny bit of the top and bottom being cut off. I don't think that's all that bad. Uh... Yeah, no, 100%. That's good enough. Yeah. Oh, there is one other thing. Because I have the GameCube set to settings that I like when I'm just playing the GameCube. Um, so right now there is a filter on the screen. Let me turn that off real quick. So do you like it better like that? Because on there is like stream compression and shit like that. And I know that scan lines and things can make it a little rough. So is it better with the, the post-processing just turned off entirely, or or like that? Like how I had it. The scan line should help the... So this will be number two, since Noodle's trying to pick number one or number two. This will be number two, with the, uh, with the scan lines on. <laughs> this will be number one. I mean, there are other settings that we could change to, like LCD would probably be pretty fitting. But I personally like the slot mask when I'm playing the GameCube on my own. But on stream, does it look better with number one or number two? Number one, number two. Noodle keeps saying both numbers, so I don't know which one <laughs> she's talking about. Number one, number two, number one. Okay. So you like it better with number one? I'm fine with number one. Doesn't matter to me, dude. I thought you were being an eye doctor. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. <laughs> Number one it is. So there is still a uh, a save game on here from, from Baby Noodle, I'm assuming. <laughs> Played a total of seven minutes of the game before they gave up. <laughs> is, did you, like, delete your save at some point? Can you even delete your save? Or <laughs> did you only play seven minutes and then give up on the game entirely? <laughs> <laughs> you don't remember? Well, we're gonna we're gonna start a new save, a fresh save. Maybe. Uh. Oh, I was on load game. That's why. You feel like you started over a bunch? Maybe. Well, we're not gonna write over baby noodle save. We're gonna start a new one here. Dear Mr. Potter, you have been accepted to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Yours sincerely, Albus Dumbledore, Headmaster. Welcome to Diagon Alley, Harry. I've never seen a place like this before. That's because there is none like it. This is Ollivander's wand? Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> We're going to have to zoom out a little bit. Let me fix it on Twitch. Well, or on OBS, I meant. But maybe it'd be simpler to just do that. It's going to have a tiny bit of a border, but like at least everything will be on screen. And I don't have to fuck up my PS2 settings, so. Like, for you join me inside. I, I'm i sure he said something, but <laughs> we were too busy looking at stuff. Can we, can we talk to people? Don't run from every creature you encounter. You can't defeat stronger creatures later unless you defeat weaker creatures now. Yeah, this is like an RPG game, isn't it? Do we have inventory, like money or anything? Level 1, no experience. We have zero sickles, so no money. Okay, and we have no items. Nice. You remember this being hard, especially the fucking bank area? I've never played this one. I'm 
I'm fairly certain I played a Harry Potter game as a kid, but oh god, I really don't remember which one. Hello, Harry. <laughs> this is Mr. Ollivander. He'll set you up with a wand. Come find me later at Gringotts Bank. Oh god, speaking of the bank area. There's only one wand for every wizard. We'll have to test a few before we find yours. Try this one first. Cool, can I blow some shit up now? Obviously not the right one for you. Maybe you'll have better luck with this wand. That's a no from me, dog. Still not working. You must need a very special wand. Hmm, I have an idea. Try this one. It's made of holly with a phoenix feather core. Oh, snap. We found just the wand for you, Harry Potter. It is equipped with the spells Flopendo and Vermilius Uno, which will protect you in magic encounters. I can't pay for it, though. Hagrid has arranged for 119 sickles to be charged to your account at Gringotts. Thank you for stopping by. I'm sure you'll put your wand to good use. You receive Harry's wand! Let's go, dude. Thank you. Oh no, Harry Potter. Thank you. You have received your wand, the most necessary equipment of any Witcher Wizard. You can now cast the first of many spells you will learn. Cool. Can I do that now? I have no items. Okay. So wait, this is like a whole fucking RPG game, huh? Use this item, yes. Oh, can't use it right now. Okay. Well, fucking two then. Hey, aren't you Harry Potter? Well, you are, aren't you? And if you're here, it means you're finally going to Hogwarts. Does everyone know everything about me? This is gonna be great. Harry Potter at Hogwarts? Is there anything I can do for you? Do you need any famous witches and wizard cards? I don't know what they are. <laughs> oh, they're the best. They're cards you collect and trade, and you can make card combinations that create magic. Sounds better than playing solitaire. I used to do that a lot. Who the fuck is this guy? Who are we even talking to right now, dude? I have a lot of spare cards. I'd be honored to give you some of them. There are four different decks you can collect. Here, pick the one you want to start with. Choose your deck. Justice Pillowickle. Gulliver Pokeby. Pokeby? Gregory the Snarmy. Merwin the Malicious. Gregory the Snarmy? The Smarmy? I... <laughs> what? Sure, Gregory the Smarmy. That's who we want, dude. This deck looks interesting enough. There are two more things you'll need. One's a Folio Magi, where you store your card collection. Well, thanks, man. The other thing you'll need is a Folio Triplicus. You store your card combinations in it. I even throw in a couple of combinations for free. Well, aren't you just the best, dude? You receive card combination. You receive card combination. Doesn't even tell us what card combination. You just you just receive a card combination. You have found a famous Witches and Wizards card. And another one. And another one. <laughs> and another one. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Thank you. This is very generous of you. I was glad to do it. Boy, wait until I tell the guys I helped Harry Potter. To view your Folio Magi Folio Triplicus, press Start to bring up the main menu and then select Folio Magi or Folio Triplicus. Okay. Folio Magi, then. Oh god, there's a lot. <laughs> I did not expect there to be this much to it, man. We got Roderick Plumpton. Thaddeus Thurkle. Thurkel. Andros the Invincible. And Hesper Starkey. Oh, we can see more about them. Alchemy? What's the alchemy thing? I'm so confused right now. Okay, what's Folio Triplicus? No wonder you were confused, Noodle. I'm confused. Okay, so because we got those three, we got that. You select card during a magical encounter to set up a card combination. Okay. I'm already lost, dude. Uh, let's just go to the bank. I'm assuming this is it. Looks like it. There's something written on the door. Enter, stranger, but take heed of what await the sin of greed. For those who take but do not earn may pay dearly in their turn. Spoopy. If you ever get lost, press select to bring up a message about your current location. I'll be honest, I don't know what the select button is on this piece of software. Uh... 
and A or B and A. L and R are that. Z. Z is, uh... Select, I guess. You are in Gringotts, the wizard bank. Okay. Mr. Hagrid is waiting for you at the far end of the building. Mr. Hagrid and Mr. Griphook have been waiting for you. Sorry, it's an RPG. I have to talk to everyone. If you're looking for Mr. Hagrid, he's back near the vaults. Mr. Potter, your party's waiting at the end of the lobby. Everyone's like, just fucking go to the end, dude. <laughs> Mr. Party, if Mr. Party, your party is waiting. Huh. Mr. Hagrid is waiting for you at the far end of the building. Is this a chest? Did I see a chest somewhere? No, I guess not. Now they're repeating messages. This part sucks, you'll probably die a lot. Only one way to find out, my guy. Okay. One of you have to say something interesting, right? Or not. That's fine, too. Hello. Uh, you look funny. Who are you? Hello, Harry. Good morning, Mr. Potter. My name is Griphook. We'd like to see Harry's vault now. Have you his key, sir? Here, tis. <laughs> and there's also the matter of the you-know-what we talked about before. All seems to be in order, then. Please follow me. Are we doing the cart ride? Stay together, please. Come on, Harry. Ah, Wait, what? Did I just die? Oh, wait. Oh, God. He was, he, he was just right there, dude. Don't tell me we got lost. I think this is where Noodle was whenever <laughs> I loaded up her save. Gringotts vaults are really safe. Okay. So how do we use... Do we just, like, run into things? You're about to enter a magical encounter and have several options. Spell lets you cast a spell. Item allows you to use an item. Card lets you create a card effect with famous witches and wizards cards. And Flea lets you attempt to escape. Your stamina magic points are shown in the display to the right. By the way, rats are with... Are, by the way, rats are with to the vermil... Okay. <laughs> I'm assuming you're saying use vermilius on the rats. Nice, dude. G fucking G. Weak fucking autocorrect. We don't have any items. Okay, so Flipendo uses no MP, though. So that's kind of the way to go. The problem is we might die because we probably don't have any healing, huh? We've already lost damn near half our health. <laughs> oh, good. He missed. I wonder... Oh, that's a little health bar next to him, isn't it? God, we really need to level up, dude. <laughs> we suck ass. I don't suppose we heal when we level up, do we? So that would be awfully helpful, my guy. Harry found a pepper up potion and six sickles. What the hell is a pepper up potion? Uh, can I have a description of it before I use it? What? <laughs> ah! <laughs> you can get healing from items they drop, but be careful. The boss is a giant-ass rat. Nice. You do heal when you level up. I guess we just use it? Okay, it recovers magic points. Yeah, yeah, you're right, Rue. Okay, um... Let's try another fight here. I want to level up a little bit. Plus, I want to see, does this one do... Okay, that does fuck all on, on the bats. Good to know, I guess. So just... Do this all day? Can we use the cards more than once? Or are they like one-time use? This card gave you a piece of candy? What does the candy do? I'm assuming that's... It seems never to lose its flavor. Plus five SP. Trash! I don't... Oh, wait. No, SP is what I wanted, actually. Flipendo is luck-based. Luck-based how? Like, how much damage it does? Or... I think we are gonna die, my dude. <laughs> gonna get a really quick sh shower. You're sleeping. You wanna lay down. I feel that, love. Oh, my God. We are so close to dying. We need a healing spell or at least some sort of healing item. Please drop healing item. We got no items. 
Fantastic. Hagrid! Why did you leave me, Hagrid? Oh, God. Are you ever going to reach your own vault? I'm trying to reach my own vault. If I get in another fight, I think I'm dead. So we're going to have to try and avoid these, these dudes for a moment. How do I know which vault is my vault? Yet another locked door. Very cool. How very locked this door is. I don't like the condescending tone you have here, game. At least all these locked doors make you feel like your phone's vault's very safe. Fair. No, this is... This is where Noodle gave up. Right there, as soon as we loaded into this room. Noodle saved the game and never played again. I'm just following the right wall, hoping for the best. I want to get into, like, I want to level a little bit. But we're dead if we do. We have, like, what, two hit points left? Uh, I'm guessing that's the boss. <laughs> uh... Well, fuck? <laughs> I mean, look, if we're dead either way, we might as well die die to the boss, right? Um, and we can see card. Yeah, no, so that is one-time use. We have no items. Oh, shit, and just clicking on item used up our turn. Well, we're dead. <laughs> G-fucking-G to us, dude. Wait, what? We're back? Hello. I can see that you are hurt. Would you like me to heal you? Yes, please. What do you charge? There is no charge. It's my duty to heal all who ask. Oh. Okay. Do we keep our experience points? There, that should feel better. Rue, you're leaving us. Have a good night, dude. Thanks for hanging out for us a little bit. Experience time. Okay, yeah. And it does seem like we keep our... Experience. Excellent. Do I still have our shirt privilege? Wait, are you asking if you can wear my shirt? Like, yeah, I don't I don't care, dude. That's fine. <laughs> You're allowed to wear it if you like. So I'm guessing we're meant to die. <laughs> A couple times while we while we level up. That's the that's the sort of thing it feels like here. And of course, it's all bats. Vermilius is still just nothing, right? Oh no, okay. So maybe when Rue said Flipendo is luck based, they meant it's uh, Vermilius is luck based. How are you still alive, my guy? Okay, so I guess now we're just grinding. <laughs> I didn't expect a Harry, uh, Harry Potter game to be to be a grind fest, but uh, <laughs> I guess it is, dude. I don't know. Trash. Die, you stupid bat. Yell me all the time, but tried to give me the wrong one the other night. I would like to make it clear that I don't yell at her all the time. <laughs> She's being dramatic. And I tried to give you a shirt because the other one was dirty, you weirdo. <laughs> I didn't think you wanted a dirty shirt. But excuse me if I was wrong. Are we doing any more damage now? Six? Uh, it seems to, seems to be about the same. We got a lot more health, though. Eleven? Eleven more points of health? It's not bad. I'm going to try to level up again. I don't know how much experience we actually need. I'm also curious if uh, if there's any like secrets here anywhere. There doesn't appear to be. Everything seems to just be locked doors and uh, little little blue goo balls on the ground. Let's go. Familius for days. Uh, you know what? Familius again. I want to get you the hell out of here. And it's zero. <laughs> GG. 
again. There we go. Although, we used four magic points. And we probably would have killed him with just two, two hits of Flipendo for zero magic points. So, not sure it was really worth it, but whatever. I can finish loading the dishwasher. That's fine. I'll, I'll finish loading it if you want. More pipes. Hey, it's a rat. We know what to do with the rats. Familius, their ass. Get out of here. Experience two, sickles two. I need a level up is what I need. The rats don't give much in the way of experience, do they? Kind of useless in that regard. That's a bat. I'm pretty sure whenever we uh, whenever we level up, we got all our, our MP back as well. So I'm just... I'm fine, like, using up a lot of the spell. I'm gonna try to hit level 3 before we go after that boss rat again. Also, I'm pretty sure we just got a crit. It appeared in red. And it was uh, over double the damage we normally do, so... Sounds like a crit if I've ever heard of one. Also, Nudor, are you okay? It sounds like you're dying down there, dude. <laughs> I can hear you coughing all the way up here over the game audio and the, the big-ass headphones on my head. I'm a little concerned. Cough twice if you're okay. <laughs> hey, we leveled up. Let's go. Strength 0, Defense 1, Agility 1, Stamina 11. That seems like a lot, but I'll take it, dude. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna try to dodge everyone, save the game, and go. Just feeding kitties? <laughs> Just feeding kitties? And not dying. <laughs> Are you sure? Okay, let's take out the little guys first, because that chip damage adds up. Except for when they hit with zero. I mean, even the big guys hitting with zero. Get wrecked, rat. Dude, another fucking crit? Let's go, my guy. I really wish there was cursor memory. Maybe that's in the options somewhere. I mean, it's it's a Game Boy Color RPG Harry Potter game. I don't I don't know if they put that much thought into it, but I would really appreciate uh, cursor memory. Bruh, too easy, man. Too easy. Pumpkin pasties. Let's go, dude. Now our nips aren't going to be hanging out all over the place. Um, save again, I guess? And is this my vault? No. <laughs> well, look. Ah, maybe this one with the dudes in front of it. Wait, what's over here? Um, I guess a fight. I guess there's a fight over here. Okay, then. Y'all can die real quick, if you don't mind. I just thought maybe there would be some secrets or something. Not more annoying-ass bats. Although, if we can level up again real quick, I wouldn't mind that so much. We don't even need to get our money out of the vault, dude. We're gonna be rich as shit just from murdering all these uh, rats and bats and shit. Alright. Let's talk to you guys. Uh, or not. There we go. There you are. You shouldn't have waddled behind like that. I've been looking for you everywhere. But I didn't go everywhere. I was right here by your vault. <laughs> but, like, dude, I've never been here before. How the fuck am I supposed to know where the vault's at? Come on, Agrid. This, this is all mine? I'm fucking rich? <laughs> Excuse me? It is. We'll be taking just enough to silver, just enough silver sickles. That's wizard money to equip you for school. Shall we go to the next vault now, sir? I we should hurry. Harry here. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> we should hurry. Harry's here's your money. Harry here's your money. Why does that sound so awkward to me? Harry here's your money and the list of what you need. Buy everything on the list. I'll pick up the you know what, then meet you in front of Gringotts. 850 sickles, let's go. School supply list. To use an item, press start to bring up the main menu, then select the item to see. Highlight the item you wish to use and press the A button. What is the you know what? Can't tell you, Hogwarts business. See you outside, Harry. 
So like, can we just skip the whole me needing to grind for money all the time? And uh, collect a bunch of gold now? Like, I feel like that should be a legit option here. No, no, can't, can't do that. None of this, just, oh. I received a card combination. Wait, was that just hidden on the ground? I didn't actually like see anything to pick up. I was just mashing A, trying to get stuff out of the, trying to get some gold here. <laughs> So wait, should we be mashing A all the fucking time? Like, as we're just walking around? Maybe. Oh god, three bats? That's actually a bit much. It's okay, I think we're close to another level up. I mean, I guess if we die, we'll get out of the vault a lot quicker, right? <laughs> uh, okay, focus on one. Focus damage, try to get it out. That'll decrease the amount we take every turn. Oh god, cutting it close though. Go for a crit, my guy. That's not a crit. Four, four, we're dead. <laughs> there's there's no question about it. I don't know what these do, so I don't want to use them. Uh okay. Kill this one, please. And then if we get lucky and the other one does zero. Yes, yes, now crit. That's not a crit. You have to hit for zero again. Bro, let's fucking go. Okay. Flipendo. We can't we can't risk the luck. Let's go. Now we get a crit though. Didn't need it there. And we still didn't level Oh, we did level up. Let's go, dude. Strength plus one, defense plus one, magic strength one, magic defense one, agility one, stamina eleven. What are our stats now? 8, 8, 8, 12, 7. What does stamina... Okay, so stamina is our actual health health. Nice. Bruh. We are gods. Wait, didn't it say we got another... Oh, like we unlocked one, but we don't have the cards for it? Oh, and it actually, like, uses up the cards, too. Okay weird. <laughs> Not at all how I thought it was going to work. Uh, but that's okay. I don't remember exactly how to get out of here. I say walking straight to the exit like a boss. Uh, this seems like a roundabout way to get where we're going. Should we grind? I mean, look. I, we're not keeping this save, so I guess there's really no reason to grind. Let's, uh, Let's just go collect all of our shit. We only got like 10 minutes left anyways. I love RPG games though. I legit would play this, man. <laughs> like, I don't know if I'd play it all on stream, but like, bruh, if I, if I ever get my hands on one of those, uh, oh God, the FPGA based Game Boy thing. I can't remember the name of it. Analog. Analog Pocket. If I ever get me an Analog Pocket, I'm probably going to play through this game. That's a fine start you've made, Aerie. Check the list I gave you and go buy the rest of your gear. I mean, I do have a Game Boy Advance. I guess I could play it on that. And then Noodle has the uh, Game Boy Color. Um, I guess I could play it on that as well. But no backlight, you know? It's kind of meh. Welcome to the healing station. Although I can see you are not injured, feel free to visit any time. Oh yeah, I just leveled up. I forgot. Why can't... Uh, game? Excuse me? What? <laughs> uh, okay. Hello. What do you sell? Buy. Chocolate frogs, every flavor beans, best blowing gum, pumpkin pasties, collagen cakes, licorice wands. It'd be really nice to know what this shit does, my guy. Let's look at our... Let's look at our list. What do we need? need three robes, one winter cloak, one pointed hat, one pair of clubs, one name tag pack, one potion kit bag, one set of first year books, one cauldron. I'm not gonna remember all that, but this this candy store doesn't have any of the shit we need at the very least, so. This looks like a good place to buy robes. Oh, hello, another random person. Oh, that's Draco. Fuck you. <laughs> hello, I'm Draco Malfoy. Are you a Hogwarts student? I will be soon. Me too. I say. I saw you earlier with that beastly servant, Hagrid. 
I like Hagrid. <laughs> Me too, Harry. Me too. Do you now? Not our sort, you know. He's almost as bad as a muggle. Perhaps worse. Well, see you later. Trash. <laughs> that dude is trash. Uh, plain work robe. So, wait, is that the kind we need to buy? Okay, well, we needed name tags, right? We needed a winter coat. Or winter cloak. And then is the plain work robe? Is that what we need? I mean, it's a robe. So if we look at our list again. Okay, yeah, three robes, one winter cloak. We need a pointed hat, a pair of gloves. I think you sell that shit here, too. Uh, dragon skin gloves. Pointed hat. Did, did we have boots on our list? Boots seem important, but no. Potion kit, first year books, and a cauldron. I don't think you had any of that stuff. Leather belt, plain boots, pack of name tags. Yeah, no, that's, that's it. Okay. Can we equip any of that shit? Surely we can, right? Yeah, dude. Give us that stuff. Dragon skin gloves? I guess. So this has more agility, but less everything else. So, I mean, I don't know. I kind of feel like we should just run around in a winter cloak all the time. We have no boots or belts. We're just running around barefoot, I guess. Oh, our sprite doesn't change. It required an equipable item. I've already figured that out. Uh, what else do we need? Where do we need? This looks like a bookstore. Books are good. Ah, young scholar. You're always welcome in Flourish and Blots. Hogwarts first year. We have your books right here. Already sorted. That would be 143 sickles. Thank you, sir. Do you have anything else, like, hidden here? Maybe, maybe some magical cards or something? No? Can we look at our books? What is this for? School books. Can't use it now. Well, <laughs> you're helpful. Thanks, man. Um. Okay, that's all blocked off. Can't leave this area. What was this one? This was the candy store, wasn't it? Yeah. That's the healer. Wait, why is... Why are the rats here? <laughs> I thought this was the safe area. Excuse me, game. These rats don't stand a chance now, dude. I got clothes on. I'm not naked no more. Wait. It just said it did one damage? But it showed us taking two. I wonder if it, like, does some rounding or something. Like, if it technically did 1.3, and then it rounds the display and the and the total differently? Like, rounded one down and the other up? I don't know. Uh, we're not gonna heal. We're fine. Ah, my mic's running away. God damn it, Mike. Okay, that's Green Gods. Um, that's the wand place. Broom? I don't think you're gonna sell what I need. Hello, young man. Are you a first-year student? Will be soon. You know I can't sell to you, of course, but look around all you like. Uh, take that Nimbus 2000 if you don't mind. Have you found any hidden items yet? There are many all around. Why, I bet there's even one inside that barrel. Huh. Yeah, so it does work that way. Just random shit all over the place with no no indication. This shop's kind of creepy. <laughs> Welcome to Ilops Owl Emporium. What year, please? Year? What do you mean? What year are you in Hogwarts? First? Second? I'm not in Hogwarts yet. Sorry, we can't really sell to you. Look around if you like, though. Good day. Wait. You can't sell to kids unless... Unless they've been in Hogwarts for a certain period of time? How does that make sense? This 
game makes no damn sense. Excuse me, sir, do you sell cauldrons and potion stuff? Potion kit bag, I'll take that. A wigan weld potion? Uh, I understand what a antidote is, but the rest of that is lost on me. Okay, I think we still need a cauldron. You look like you would sell a cauldron. Are you a collector? I have a card that might interest you. You mean a famous witches and wizards card? Well, maybe. My collection is quite small at the moment. This one is very rare. Cersei yourself. Want to trade? What do you want for it? A Bazaar stone. Interested? I don't even know what that is. Must be a firsty. Sorry to bother you. Well, <laughs> is there a Bazaar just like hiding in one of these barrels here or something? Oh, we've got some money. I like money. Hello. You look like you sell cauldrons. Collapsible cauldron? Copper cauldron. Copper cauldron, please. I don't know the difference. All potions are made in cauldrons. If you select and use your cauldron, you will get a screen showing all ingredients you have. Select the ingredients you want and then press start to mix them. Do we have any? Uh, ingredients? Use item. Choose your ingredients, press start to mix them. Okay, no, we don't have any ingredients yet. Fair. And what's the difference of the copper one and the, uh... The collapsible one, then? You're him. I mean, you're you. I mean, you're Harry Potter. Uh, so I've been told. Fucking rats, dude. Somebody should really deal with this rat problem. How is there not a spell to just, like, banish all the rats from... From the alleyways? Yes, I know, guy. I'm trying to do stuff. How much money do we have? Is that under status? 198. Is that enough to buy a pair of boots? Maybe, maybe a, uh... Maybe a belt. Boots and a belt would, would both be awfully, awfully nice. Oh. I guess we're fighting more rats. Die. Thank you. Familius Uno. I don't remember that spell. Is that a real spell? I don't remember. I feel like that's fake, dude. Damn it. <laughs> Why are the rats everywhere? I'm just trying to explore, my guy. Rats never stood a chance against the great Harry Potter. Get wrecked. Well, at least we're getting a shit ton of uh, pasties. Best thing about the shopkeepers here is they're all honest. You know, I I never questioned them being honest until you said that. Now I'm not so sure. <laughs> are, we, are they actually? Are they stealing from me? They might be stealing from me. I still don't know what's up with that random owl there. Uh, okay, you're the healer. You're the candy. I want clothes, please. Never had clothes on my own, you see. I would like a leather belt, cheap as hell, and some plain boots. That's it. That's all I wanted. Some plain boots. And a leather belt. There we go. Now we're all decked out, dude. It's nice to finally be wearing actual clothes, not just running around in the nude. Alright, Agrid. I got all my shit. What now? Give up the school supply list. What on, Ari? There's one last thing. Happy birthday. Hey, we got Hedwig. Let's go. She's beautiful. What's her name? She be Hedwig. All the kids want owls. They carry your mail and everything. Noodle, thank you so much for the five bits, love. I appreciate you. Well, time for us to be on our way. Now we're off to King's Cross Stationery. Find platform nine and three quarters and look for the Hogwarts Express. You have completed buying all the items on your school list. Now you can leave for Hogwarts. Let's go. Hello, sir. Do you know where platform nine and three quarters is? Oh, you're here to see your grandson off to Hogwarts. I was hoping we'd have, like, that moment from the movie where we talk to the guy and he's like, What do you think I am, thick? And you 
fucking children. Uh, waving his fists. That's not what happened, but <laughs> close enough. <laughs> Anyways, guys, uh, the game is surprisingly decent. I would probably play it, as I mentioned before. I probably will, eventually. But thanks for coming and hanging out with me for a little bit while we played a, a little bit of PS2 stuff in this random-ass Harry Potter game. I hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. I certainly did. Until next time, though, be kind to each other, and have a good night, y'all. Bye-bye.